from a government matter stage in a jang is now a free man. It comes after the High Court sitting in just today discharged and acquitted him of the 6.3 billion naira corruption charges leveled against him by the Economic and Financial Crimes Commission. A court presided over by Justice Christy Dampop has also discharged and acquitted a former cashier in the office of the Secretary to the Plateau State Government, Yusuf Pam, who was accused alongside the former governor. Justice Dabob held that the prosecution lacked evidence to prove the allegations of embezzlement and misappropriation against the accused. Counsel to the EFCC and the defendants bear their minds on the judgment. The judge analyzed all the exhibit standard, analyzed the testimony of all the 14 witnesses. 98% of these witnesses more or less testified in favor of David Jonah Jang. Each of them said not one combo was found with him. Not one combo was found in his account or found in his wife's account or found in his office or found in his children's account or found in his relations account or found in any of his bank accounts. The court found this man innocent of all the 17 counts charged. And one would have wondered, why was this man being persecuted instead of being prosecuted? But today, justice has been served. This case was initially before Honorable Justice Longji. And um, before that judge, the prosecution called 12 witnesses and closed its case. The defendants then made no case submission. Upon their no case submission, the Leonard trial judge in that instance ruled that the defendants had a case to answer and the defendants were to enter their defense. But unfortunately, his lordship retired immediately after delivering that ruling. Now the case was uh, brought before a new judge. The prosecution called 14 witnesses and tendered even more documents than the ones that were tendered before the former judge. This time around, the defendants surprisingly rested their case on that of the prosecution. So, but now the judge has ruled that yes, in respect of the whole 17 counts, none of the counts was established beyond reasonable doubt.